in Charlotte, and it was like ten dollars for this water. Like, like a regular burger would probably be like five bucks in the south. Like, like this is why I'm like this bomb. This salad was bomb though. Like this salad for the win. It's awesome. Dude, I just had to like run through the whole fucking airport because they changed my gate at the last second. And I just went and bought this huge Kit Kat and this Cosmo with Megan Fox and they'll have like a ton of magazines in my house but I forgot to bring them so yeah. and like I got a little shuttle ticket for eight dollars to take a shuttle to my hotel um, because my friends are already at the hotel they arrived yesterday so they're not here to travel with me and then this guy that was next to me on the airplane he offered me um, to give me a ride because he has a rental like he's getting but one I didn't feel like waiting for it and two like I don't know my friend was just like you don't want to be kind of like on that um, movie taken I mean not that he wasn't nice he was super sweet and like Strangers sometimes are kind, but still, my friend was like, why don't you just take the shuttles, like $8, so I was like, okay. So now I'm just waiting here, and it's so fucking hot, like, I'm really glad that I brought all those crop tops and shorts, because it's fucking hot as shit, like, oh my god, last time I was in Vegas, it was like March, so it was not this hot, now it's July, and it's like, fucking fuck, and it's like 12, well, what time is it, it's like, look at my ticket well it's 8 45 p.m but i'm thinking it's 11 45 because i'm still in virginia time but yeah it's like nighttime and it's fucking hot but i'd rather be too hot than too cold though so yeah yeah i just got to my hotel room this is my own my friends are staying in a suite but since i'm a girl i wanted to get my own room so we do a little room tour so, and this is, by the way, MGM's signature, if you guys are wondering. So this is a shower, tub, two sinks, bathroom. This is a whole lot of space for just me, but hey, I like it like that. Nice little closet. I don't have that much stuff, though. And I have a little kitchen, microwave, little table. Let me see if I can turn this one. And there's the outside. So, you can kind of see a little bit. The little sofa area and the bed. Yay!
So I'm just getting ready. I just did my hair and we're about to go like walk around or I don't know what we're gonna do, but we're not going out like clubbing or anything tonight because we have to work in the morning, maybe tomorrow night, I don't know. But we're just gonna go walk around and stuff like that. <laughs> Okay, so I just bet in black, so that means that like... You hit black, you basically don't really want to bet black. And then if I lose, then I just dump it. It's great. <laughs> okay, what am I supposed to press? Look at this. I hit it already. Dope. What? You gotta hit it one more time. Alright, go. Alright, don't stop. Don't hit it. We didn't win shit. You got $19.50, hit it again. <laughs> what am I doing to press? Alright, well, I got it this time. Dollars, wow. Cash out. Oh, one more time. Cash out. Cash out. Good morning. This is the view from my hotel. Right here. I don't have a balcony like my friends do, but it's okay. So I'm just getting ready now, like, eating some ramen. I'm waiting for, like, them to bring me some silverware. I have nothing to eat this with. Like, I have no forks, no spoons, nothing. I'm just, like, and they've been, like, taking 30 minutes. Other than that, they're awesome, their service. But, like, other than this, they've been, like, 30, taking 30 minutes to fucking bring me some silverware. Like, what the fuck, yo? I can't eat this. Like, I need some food. I need some sustenance. <laughs> and I'm not naked, I promise. I have a towel on, but... Yeah, I'm just getting ready. I just had to call them again because I was like, dude, like, can I have some silverware? I guess they just forgot or something. I don't know. But I love the fact that they have free Wi-Fi in here. Like, normally hotels do not. You have to, like, pay for it. So this is awesome. Like, paying, like, 20 extra bucks for the signature was so totally worth it. And I got it through Groupon. Like, I'll link it below. But you guys, this is awesome. Like, look at all the shit that I get. Like, all to myself. This is all my own. Fuck yeah. Okay, so I just tried to call like the third, no, fourth time for my silverware and scissors because these shorts, like the buttons will not go through. Like I cannot put them on. Like I need scissors because the buttons are new. These are brand new. So, but the silverware, I called four times and they're still, they, they won't answer. Like the, like when I just called, it was just like keeps beeping. It's like, er, er, er. like I'm like, dude, what the fuck? Like, I'm trying to eat and get out of here because I have to be I have to be out of here at 10 a.m. so we can walk to the convention center like to work and it's like 10 a.m. basically like what the fuck Miss still needs to get my makeup and hair done like yeah and I don't know where's my silverware it's already 9:57 like oh my gosh I don't know what they're doing like bro I don't know. I've never had this before. Hey, they just finally brought my set of silverware, like, after five times calling them. Yeah. So I can eat now. Hey, guys. So I'm just at the booth over here. And this is what it looks like. So we're just getting, we're waiting for people to get here. It's still early in the morning. I'm so tired. Like, really tired. But I'm not hungover, though, so that's good. Got this chicken sandwich. Yeah. So we just got done for the day. We're about to cab it back to the hotel. Real, come on. Now arriving at Harry. 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 Now arriving at Harry.
Stadium's Thrive Passion Outlets of the Las Vegas Shopping Center, located on the MGM Grand. Enjoy a short drive through the picturesque desert. Head to the front door of the best outlet shopping in Las Vegas. Shop the indoor outlet center with stores like Nike, Lacoste, Chico's, Coach, Levi's, Michael Ford's, Neiman Marcus, Last Call, and many more. Show your Las Vegas monorail ticket and get a half price ticket for the Fashion Outlet Shopper Shuttle plus a free green sandwich car. Shuttle departs on the MGM Grand from 9.15 a.m. until 2 p.m. You are now arriving at the MGM Grand Station. This is the last stop. Okay, I'm like so tired. My feet hurt and I can't get into my room. I'm waiting for somebody right now to come up because I can't get in. And like I had to went downstairs to give me another key and it still won't work. Now I'm waiting for someone to come up here and tell me. And like my feet hurt so much. They blistered from wearing heels all day and all night last night. Like I'm not happy right now. I just want to get in my fucking room. So this is what it looks like. I'm just walking around right now. There's CW and TV. There's CS. I'm walking around getting some food. So like I have this voucher they gave me for 50 bucks for my room. So I'm like, hey, I might as well use it, right? So I'm just going to go get a snacky real quick. I don't know where, but it's got a bunch of restaurants on it. So I'll figure it out. Like everything's so pretty and the music is awesome and like, I don't know, I've missed today yet since last time I was here. happy right now it's just like the atmosphere here is just so awesome and I haven't had a beer in so long like like months like a long time but that's not why I'm happy I'm just not saying that by the way but like I'm just so happy right now like and I'm fine like walking around like on my own because my friends are taking a nap and I don't need one anymore I was gonna take one after work but I decided not to, but I probably will because we're going out tonight, so I don't know, but I'm so excited, like this is awesome, fucking happy as shit. So I found it, like, the thing to like double pay, and this is it, and it just says restaurant, I thought it was going to be like a huge club that I could actually like see what it looks like, but nope, and this is the centrifuge, and this is like some awesome staircase, but I guess this is it, like, though. <laughs> okay, so I just got my food. I got this like chicken from Wolfgang Pack Barn Grill. And I was walking around taking selfies while I was waiting for the food to get done. And this guy started talking to me and like he's in social media as well. It was cool. So we chatted for a bit and now I'm just heading back to my room so I can enjoy the dinner. Oh my gosh, I'm already like super happy and now this song started playing I overhead the Jello. Um what's it called? Oh it's called If You Have My Love. And that's like my favorite song ever, or one of my favorites, but it makes me so happy. But like how bet how much better can this get? Like it's a vacation, like I'm so fucking happy. Look at my shit. I'm walking with all of this stuff right now. But like this is so awesome, I'm just like happy as fuck. Okay, I just put my little dinner on this plate in my room. Yay, I'm so happy. Okay. Here I am. Um, look at this huge bed all to myself. Oh my god, you guys, tonight I didn't even go out. Like we were supposed to go out. We had like all these plans for like bottles and all this shit and like 
I fucking fell asleep, like, for seven hours. I was so dead. I was so dead. Like, and now it's, like, 5 a.m., and I'm wide awake, and I'm, like, thinking maybe I should just walk around downstairs or something, like, all the shops and stuff. But at the same time, it's, like, I have to be up early anyway, and, like, I might as well just get up at, like, 8 and go to the pool or some shit. So probably going to do that. I don't know. But, like, yeah, I slept for a long time. I fell asleep at, like, 9, 30, 10, and woke up at, like, 4. Yeah, like, and tomorrow's my last day. So this is the end of our day two. The trade show, we just finished, and we're trying to get a cab back to the hotel. Like, I don't know what we're doing, but um, at least we're down for the trade show, so that's it. Like, I'm so tired. Like, at least I'm not as tired as I was yesterday. I had some sleep last night, but I don't know what we're doing. But I'm glad that it's, like, at least dry heat. It's kind of, like, in Ukraine, like, here for Ukraine because in Norfolk, Virginia, it's, like, so humid. It's so humid, and, like, you know, hair gets oily, your skin gets oily, it's so annoying. This hair is like dry, so that's a bonus. You don't have to wash your hair and look like a grease ball. What? No, I'm closing this shit. Like, oh, well, I'm doing a video. Do you want to do a video? Just come say hi. Oh, this concrete's hot. So we just got done with the vape show and I'm just sitting out here in the balcony enjoying the view and some ramen noodles. <laughs> so fancy. But we have to leave in like four hours so not much to do. There's a pool down there. Yeah, so that's the pool down there. And this is the view. Ah! From the MGM signature and that's the strip. Yeah. We only have like a couple more hours to go till we leave, so I'm just getting some mom <laughs> so glam. Well. You know, and then we're leaving. So that's the view. Hey guys, sorry I didn't finish my vlog from Vegas. I'm back in Virginia now. Like last night I just basically went downstairs and I was hanging out with some friends and we just got some drinks and stuff like that, gambled a bit and like just the whole ordeal to get to the airport was a nightmare because like I was a little drunk so I didn't even think they were gonna let me on the plane but I was all good so like that happened so that's why I didn't vlog it was just like hectic like I barely made my flight basically like I had to check my bag it was just like a big deal so like that's why I didn't vlog anything but yeah I'm back now and yeah so I hope you guys enjoyed my vlog from Vegas